Hi there, and welcome to Celeb Hut. You all know the show just got insane, and you all need to plunk down for this since Diddy just emerged to uncover Jay-Z now, and it seems as though he may be attempting to bring Jay-Z down with him. Diddy has found himself mixed up with a ton of lawful difficulty and, furthermore, was getting dropped by the business. However, because of this, Jay-Z has exceeded all expectations to remove himself, and Diddy is out for retribution, so purportedly he emerged for certain weighty receipts. You know how Jay-Z has been blamed for undermining Beyoncé. Well, Diddy is currently bringing some serious and intriguing proof about how Jay-Z supposedly univs his paramours to cover his tracks and try not to get uncovered. Definitely feel free to get your teacups because this blend is wild and I'm going to spill this tea like crazy. Miss Diddy is sincerely attempting to send Jay-Z to jail. Now you all know that they say that depressed people tend to depress everyone around them. Well, Diddy is evidence that this colloquialism is genuine on the grounds that word on the road says that he may be attempting to bring down his previous best friend, Jay-Z. Apparently, the manly relationship between these two men has something to do with how Jay-Z has gone well beyond moving away from Diddy due to the wreck that Diddy is currently in. I try not to think I really want to dive into an excess of insight concerning Diddy and his ongoing circumstances, since I'm almost certain you all undeniably saw my recordings about how he's been sued multiple times by five unique individuals for supposed Sayan. And that is not the kind of thing that celebs believe their fans should contemplate. It goes without saying that Jay-Z would rather not be related to this present circumstance, since it'll make him look awful by affiliation. For those of you who don't know, Jay-Z and Diddy have been best buds since the 90s. They're near the point where Jay-Z is the main individual that Diddy permits to call him by his most memorable name. There's just a single individual, and I call him Sean. That is Jay-Z. We call each other Sean. Okay, no doubt no other person could consider me. Sean's the main individual who sings. There's not a single individual that's beyond family. That ought to be beyond my mom. Okay, that ought to call me. Better believe it, they ought to call me. Sean was, moreover, a steady face at Jay-Z's yearly Stone Country early lunch, yet Diddy most likely felt that Jay-Z would be a rare example of individuals who might stick next to him and presumably attempt to make a couple of things happen to a great extent to assist Diddy with overcoming what is going on. The Jay-Z says psych and has left Diddy hanging since just left in the virus. Well, Diddy is finished, sitting quietly and endured many shots with his standing failing endlessly further, particularly. Since he makes them interest and truly sort of delicious tea about Jay-Z and how he's supposedly been at fault for doing some that would get him executed via virtual entertainment. Now we ought to have saw this approaching. On the grounds that later Cassie energized the principal claim against Diddy Puma, W made a strong case about how Jay-Z was the genuine miscreant that everyone believed that Diddy was. She proceeded to guarantee that Jay-Z purportedly has a great deal of carefully guarded secrets. And he's been really brilliant and knows how to cover his tracks. And that is the reason he had never gotten uncovered or sued like Diddy, who had been messy. Sean Carter is more terrible. Oh, dear goodness, man. He's more astute. He's patient. And he's not messy. This has been arranging individuals he calls companions and venturing to the side while they get hit by the Gill Group for 30 years currently. Jack Wright additionally had something intriguing to say about Jay-Z's relationship with Diddy, and she implied that there could have been some fooling around happening among their kinship with Honeycombs, and also known as a diddler. I mean Diddy, and, um, for what reason do you give him the Honeycombs? Why and for what reason do you give him the Honeycombs? because he smacked so sweetly that homosexual in any case. Uh, so what precisely does Diddy need to say regarding Jay-Z, and for what reason is he presently shouting out about his previous best? Well, to begin with, Diddy had some tea about Jay-Z's supposed undertakings and how he has been undermining Beyoncé. Yet hello, Beyoncé herself, let us know that T.E. and Lemonade. I mean, she made a whole collection about it and gotten her pack in the process. Now Jay-Z likewise chatted on himself in his collection. 444, when he talked about his undertakings and how he made Beyonce extremely upset. 
So, Diddy's tea will be still correct, well, not precisely in light of the fact that Diddy is offering more data about how Jay-Z has, in addition to the fact that cheating been on Beyonce, how he's been purportedly attempting to yuan alive his special ladies to cover his tracks. Now, Jay-Z has an extremely lengthy line of affirmed and claimed escorts, yet the insane story has to do with a lady named Kathy White, since she bafflingly wound up dying right when she was going to spill the tea on their issue, J. Z has been reputed over the years to have purportedly unived Kathy to conceal the way that he was supposedly, going behind Beyonce's back with her. However, in light of the fact that the story is wild, Kathy wound up in an exceptionally predicament as one of Jay-Z's supposed escorts, and her story took a dull turn for certain in a serious way, obscure and puzzling conditions. What adds fell to the fire is that her passing coincided with Beyonce's pregnancy with Jay-Z. No doubt you know the pregnancy where their kin were feeling that she was faking being pregnant with the collapsed midsection. And all that definitely is sufficient to cause a stir, however, to make things significantly sketchier. Kathy purportedly contacted a columnist indicating a meeting where she'd spilled tea about her undertaking with Jay-Z. And you can wager Jay-Z could never have needed that kind of tattle out in the open tales connecting Kathy, and Jay-Z began whirling when they were spotted together at a club with one of Jay-Z's dearest companions, who turned out to be way forward. As a matter of fact, Diddy himself now, while they were all in the neighborhood for the Floyd Mayweather and Juana Manuel Marquez, bout A, as per reports not long before the pair went to the wrongdoing city battle. Jay bought a 2,500 sets of Louis Rod shoes for Katie to wear that night. Insiders say that Jay mentioned that she carry a couple of companions to ride with them that night for them to not show up as a couple during their time in Vegas. Jay likewise took her betting at the Bellagio Club, which is where Jay was, again, supposedly resolute about her companions surrounding the pair during their time at the table, trying to cover they. Our public appearances as per reports. Jay-Z and Kathy were purportedly involved before he even began dating Beyonce, yet he eventually decided to focus on Beyonce in light of the fact that, duh, do you recall Jason Lee and his new dangers to uncover some harming data about Beyonce? Diddy is currently recommending that this may be associated with Kathy's unfavorable passing. In light of the fact that Kathy and Jazz were tight mates and Jason was quick to spill the tea about the undertaking, however, we should rewind to the actual issue. After Jason released the report about the undertaking, sensationalist newspapers and bloggers burned through no time in connecting with Kathy, trusting she dole out the subtleties. The word on the road is that she got an enticing proposal from a big-name newspaper, and she even gave Jay-Z a fair warning that she was all set to go public. Well, only a couple of days after the fact that Beyoncé dropped the sensation that she was expecting Blue Ivy, and in what is by all accounts a bit of a photograph of Jay. Kathy and Diddy surfaced web-based not long after apparently affirming the undertaking as per Diddy, who accepts that Kathy might have coordinated the break as recompense for Jay-Z walloping her with the child declaration. Jay-Z confronted a significant reaction for undermining Beyonce, and the sensationalist newspapers were clamoring to hear Kathy's side of the story, yet amazingly, she died under 24 hours after the photographs hit the web, and discussed some genuinely dubious timing. Adding to the entry, Kathy's virtual entertainment accounts vanished after her passing, prompting the hypothesis that she could have been hushed. A few fingers were pointed at Jay-Z, implying that he might have been engaged with her end. Anyway, there's been no substantial proof to help these cases, leaving everything covered in secret, yet it's sufficient to creep you out. What's really perplexing is the conditions encompassing her demise. The underlying post-mortem examination report expressed the head injury has the reason, however, an ensuing report proposed that it was an aneurysm. While aneurysms can, without a doubt, strike out of the blue, the unexpected change in reason for death raises doubts going from an actual physical issue to an aneurysm that is most certainly dubious and right when you figured it proved unable deteriorate and puzzling reports from the NYPD investigator. Regulating the case went against the aneurysm de termi.
Nation writer Claudia Jordan dug further into the examination, uncovering stunning disclosures she composed by a NYPD analyst who let me know Kathy's reason for death was unsure. And sometime in the afternoon, we will have the post-mortem and toxicology reports right now. The demise is considered dubious. She proceeded with an emergency call rolled in from a condo on 130 West 19th Road in Manhattan. A rescue vehicle came and took Kathy on the grounds that she was debilitated. They took her to the A. Beth Israel Medical Clinic. And that is where she terminated. It was too soon to conjecture that an aneurysm killed her. They will do an examination sometime in the afternoon to look at her reason for death. Yet somebody could have given Kathy a terrible medication, so they'll do a toxicology and will need to hang tight 14 days for that report. Now the way that the post-mortem examination results were never made, public just extends the secret encompassing Kathy's demise. Like there's a thick smo. Key screen encompassing the entire experience, and did purportedly accepts that there's a concealment, and that Jay-Z may be behind it, supposedly presently recollect Kathy's arrangement to spill Tito with the columnist before her unfavorable destruction. Subscribe Celeb Hut for more videos.